Betty. Welcome back to my kitchen. Tonight's pasta night in our household, and as usual, we're going to have our favorite Caesar salad to accompany it. First, I'm going to make the crouton that will go in the salad. And I have sort of a no-mess way of doing this. I've cut up some uh, country bread and put it in a foil-lined pan. I'm going to drizzle some olive oil over it. And shake over some garlic powder and just give it a toss. I'm going to pop these in a convection oven. I've got it fairly hot at 380 degrees and I'll put these in for about five minutes. I'll set my timer here. While the croutons are baking, I'm going to make my dressing. First, I'm going to add an egg. A tablespoon of Dijon mustard, a tablespoon of anchovy paste, and I'm going to grate in about a half clove of garlic. I like to grate this so that there's no chance of getting a lump of garlic in the dressing. Maybe just a tad more. Okay. Now I want a drop or two of fresh lemon juice. And a few drops of Worcestershire sauce. Okay. Now I'm gonna give that just a whiz to get those ingredients blended. Now that that's blended, I'm going to add some olive oil, about a quarter cup or so. And then we'll blend this again. <laughs> I think that's blended enough. We'll check. And sure enough, we have a nice creamy dressing. All right, we have what's called a heart of romaine here. And what I'm going to do is just make a few cups through it. And give it a chop. Okay, into the salad spinner. And I'll give it a quick rinse and spin it and it will be all ready for our salad. It's into the salad spinner and we'll give it a few spins to get rid of the excess water. My croutons are nicely browned. All I have to do now is let them cool off before I complete my salad. We're ready to pour the dressing onto the salad. This won't use all of it, but it will uh, save in the refrigerator for two or three days. Oops. With my impeccably clean fingers. Now I'm going to put in some grated Parmesan freshly grated Parmesan. Give that a nice toss. Add some of the croutons. Give that another little toss. And for a nice little finish, using a, just a, a potato peeler, a few peelings of Parmesan cheese on top. Pass a pepper grinder at the table to add some freshly ground black pepper, and there you have a Caesar salad. <laughs> 